so what's up guys welcome back to a brand new video and today i'm gonna be teaching you guys how can you increase your vram so vram is used to play games on more fps and do graphics uh, work on average good uh, speed all right so today we're gonna upgrade vram with your ram random access memory so first of all you have to know one thing that how much ram does your computer have so my computer have 4 gb of ram so then uh, next you have to download these two files you'll get that link on the description just extract this file right here extract it then after you have completed the extraction then just you can delete this zip file now you got two files one is the folder of intel usd graphics driver and one is intel vm auto so now just uh, point your cursor at the start menu right click on it then select device manager you'll see an option called display adapters just click on the left arrow then you'll see intel uhd graphics then just single click on it and then click on update dri uh, device driver then just click on browse my computer for drivers then tap on let me pick a list from drivers <coughs> now then just click on have disk then just click on browse then just look at your folder which you already extracted just open the folder then you will find a file called intcdaud.ins double click to open the file then click on ok and then click on next i'm not gonna do it because if i do it my screen recording will be stopped so i have already done it you will just press next then it will ask you some yes or no question you just tap yes yes and your device driver will be updated so now after you have upgraded your device driver then right click on intel vm auto then show more options then click on edit then run then now you have this notepad open now you will need to know how much ram your pc has so my has uh, 4 gb of ram so this is by default set to 200 so 200 means it's for 4 gb ram device if you have 8 gb then just get it on 400 if you have 2 gb then get it on 100 so my is uh, 4 gb then i'm gonna go with 200 so just double click on it then click on run then click on yes then click on yes then ok and that's how you upgrade your vm so much easy now you can play any games do whatever you want at maximum fps this whole video's credit goes to this guy because this video's ideas has been inspired by this guy as you can see any problem just go to this guy and subscribe him also and you will find every solution of any PC or Kali Linux, everything. So sub to this guy and also sub to me. So till then, bye bye.